this is almost like it's a Jerry thing as well. Like she likes this commercial. She's like, Oh, I think this commercial is clever. And he's like, well, you like this commercial <laughs> and he can't let it go. Yeah. He's really upset Hung about up the on fact this that this chick likes this commercial. He thinks it's stupid. And at this point it's sort of like they're having this little like tiff about this commercial, you know? Um, but I mean, Jerry's got to just fucking chill. I what it's, yeah. what it's, Do you it's, think it's, it was him being like a comedy snob? Like, like you ever feel like your, your opinion is a little bit superior? Bless you. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I would, I could understand that. He was just sort of like, I mean, I get, look, taste is important, right? Yeah. So taste is really important. So if let's say you're dating a fucking person and they love shitty music, shitty movies, yes. shitty they comedy, sure listen to all their shitty sh- things yes it's terrible well you how do you feel about yourself you're almost going like they like all this shitty stuff am i shitty (laughs) am i I just another shitty thing on the laundry list of shit (laughs) things that this person enjoys what's wrong with you yeah i mean taste is um no that never even occurred to me (laughs) but (laughs) it's very indicative of sort of who they are deep down it's so funny because that's why me and my son's mother didn't work out was specifically because um she likes black guys. No, because <laughs> she likes big black dick. And no, her her taste. We have very very different tastes. Yes, and it wasn't even that like we couldn't accept it. It was like I remember one time we went on a, a long road trip, and I don't. I will admit that I'm wrong now. After the fact, but and long road trips are very trying. So with you, I I guarantee it's particularly difficult. I think we drove to Vermont. Oof. She might have even been pregnant at the time. Oh, you're at your B&B, your, <laughs> your bed and breakfast from our first episode. Yeah, the bed and breakfast. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure um, she let me drive at one point, and I was like, oh, well, I'm driving, I'm picking the music. She was like, okay. And then I put, <laughs> oh, on, God. I put on death metal, not even like hair metal or fun, like, Anything with a, like with Metallica a or Megadeth. <laughs> like, I put on like Iced Earth. Or like it was, I mean, it was the heaviest of the heaviest. Just like I blast, Why? blast beat, just like. <laughs> and she was uh, the look on her face. She was like, head was throbbing. She's like, what? I like, I, I'm pregnant. Please stop. Like, I just want to enjoy this five hour car ride, please. And I put my foot down. I absolutely. Ref- I was like, no, we're listening to this. I'm driving. I'm picking the fucking music. Beatrice, I'm so sorry. Beatrice, I'm sorry for him. I I think back in retrospect, I'm like, wow, I was a piece of shit. What a piece of shit. What a horrible human being. Like nobody. How selfish and thoughtless. I like rap music. I like pop music. I like 90s rock. I like 80s jazz. You like show tunes. (laughs) You like jazz. I like it all. I just refuse to let her you like have country yeah. <laughs> why but why i refuse let her i mean it. okay can i hear okay was she obnoxious with the music while she was driving like was it like uh, where she was being spiteful and then you felt like wait till i get my turn bitch no it was like <laughs> she was giving it fun and light. she didn't like any of the things that i liked so I was almost spiting her. I'm like, well, fuck, if you don't like it, good. You're, You're gonna extra really not gonna, not gonna like, like this. <laughs> and that was a problem. And really, I will admit that. Did that, you think that that was going to fix things in the relationship, showing her? No, no. I wasn't trying to fix myself until way after it was over. <laughs> I wasn't trying to make myself a better person until oh way God. after the fact. Wow. But yeah, we just didn't like the same type of movies. The same type of music. <laughs> and I would force her every night. I mean, she hated to watch horror. I mean, it, I don't even understand how me and my son's mother got together. Like, I, I don't even. We understand had no that common ground at all. No, I think you're two very similar people. Um, we. I think we were as far as driving forces, as far as like mentally, I, I, I think you're you're more similar than the you think. Comedy, politics. No, yeah, it's all television the opposite. shows. I mean, it is so. But I mean, TV I guess shows though. They say opposites attract, right? DJ Scat Cat, Paul Abdul. I, I, they I did say that. I, they did say that. We come together. And you can't argue with them. I mean, they made a lot of really good points. Who would have thought ah, we could be lovers? She makes the bed and he seals the covers. That cat oh was God, a dick, by the way. about you and Beatrice. Yeah, it really is. <laughs> uh, she likes it neat and I make a mess. Yes. <laughs> she takes it easy, baby. I get upset. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. Get out of my fucking house! <laughs> <laughs> I am DJ Scat Cat. Oh I just realized. 
<laughs> you were so cute. No. What are, what are the lyrics to, to that? I mean, he was a real fucking dick. He, no, no, yeah. Uh, he was broke as well. Yeah. Yeah. It was, she was way too hot for him. Yeah, she was Paula Abdul. <laughs> he was a cartoon homeless alley cat. <laughs> Who treated her like shit. Yeah, like his idea of like taking her dinner was like a garbage can lid with some fish bones on it. <laughs> and that was what they were going to have for dinner that night. And she's like, I'm Paula fucking Abdul. I'm about to be a Fuck host you, of American Idol. Cat. <laughs> DJ's cat get probably had AIDS. If we're, Beat it, if we're, if you we're, feral thing. There's no way he did not have feline AIDS. He was banging cats in alleyways. Let me see. Let's see the lyrics. Give me these. Um, let's see. Baby, seem never to agree. You like the movies and I like TV. I take things serious and you take them light. I go to bed early and I party all night. Our friends are saying we ain't gonna last because I move slowly and baby, I move fast. He was a fucking, he was the best, dude. DJ Scat Cat <laughs> is my up. idol. <laughs> I learned how he to He likes be... to shout, let me say. Yeah, let me say, let's see. I take two steps forward. Yes, I like it does. quiet, and I love to shout. You take two steps back. Yeah. Keep going down, Harrington. There's more. Let's see. The opposite of the track. She makes the bed, and he steals the cover. She likes it neat, and he makes a mess. Mm -hmm. I take it easy, baby. I get upset. She's got the money. She's got the money, and he's always broke. I don't like cigarettes, and I like to smoke. Ooh. Things in common. But just ain't a one. But when we get together, it ain't nothing but fun. This was me and Beatrice. Aww. I'm gonna. This is our song. I'm gonna That's send her. Song. Uh, you know we should get back together. Yeah. <laughs> I just <added> all this up. <laughs> Har Harrington, you know what? Uh, we gotta stop the recording right now. I'm missing Beatrice right now. She really is my Paula Abdul <laughs> to her DJ Scat Cat. <laughs> yeah, you really are her DJ Scat Cat to her Paula Abdul. <laughs> <laughs> DJ Scat Cat was a piece yes. of shit. <laughs> I agree. He needed to make some positive changes in his life before he was ready you for You know what, Paul though? Apple. I bet he wouldn't be blasting death metal <laughs> as he drove her nine months pregnant to Vermont. She likes it quiet. <laughs> he likes to blast I ice bet earth. He even said, you know what, babe? You could have this one. <laughs>